Yes, guys, how you doing? Welcome to Don't Trust Hannah. Um, I'll be joining on the next episode of Game of Thrones. This one? Not the next one. Because it, gets, because it gets juicy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Because it gets juicy. Who and I want to be there says? to see the performance. You can't just pick up this channel. Yes, I can. And drop it whenever you like. Shh. Ow. Now, listen. Ash, my lip. I didn't even hit you. I saw it. Wow. Say sorry. I'm sorry, but I just, I was trying to shush you. I have a sore lip. I actually have Guys, control over listen, this channel. Listen, listen. You listen. don't have control over this channel and you can't bear it. We have a Joffrey in the making, ladies and gentlemen. Persian Jordan. Joffrey. Persian Joffrey. Guys. Oh, wow. He's left the door open, so the lighting's bad. I have to wait. If you want a job done, get yourself. Guys, we're back. I'm not going to lie to you, after the last episode, I'm a little bit scarred for life. Genuinely concerned. Oh, Ash is back, blocking the light. <laughs> but yeah, I'll be joining in episode six. I can't wait. Now, season three, that's where I'd be, uh, I think I'll be a regular on season three. Because season three is my favourite. And, and personally, I would love to watch this with Hannah on my own, you know. But I just want to see her reaction. Now... Guys, make sure you head down to Hannah's subscribe button. Finger it for me, okay? Caress it. Do some like, likings. Do some like. And also share it with your friends. Because, you know, we've got to get the viewerships up. Wow. Anyway, sorry before that rude interruption from that random guy. After the last episode, honestly, I don't know what's going to happen. We may as well have UFOs landing. That's the vibes I'm getting. Because this is just madness. Insanity is what this is. And I'm here for it! My son has no interest in the Iron Throne. It's true! It's true! Don't give her that untrusting look. It's true! Your son can go on calling himself king in the north, mm -hmm. provided he swears me an oath of fealty. The same Ned Stark swore to Robert yep. 18 years ago. Their friendship held the kingdoms together. Okay. Uh, he's genuine. I think he is genuine. Negotiate a peace with your brother. Negotiate so with Stannis. <sighs> There's absolutely no hope. He's done with the Red Lady. Do you know what I mean? I think we've got a certain little thing to worry about there with that puff of black smoke. Oh, my God! Baby's here. What? No, 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 no. You'll die for this. No, no. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't you go after her. She done nothing wrong. She has only ever stood up for him. She's heartbroken. Did you not see her little face when he just got done? He just got killed by the smoke. Sorry, this smoke, this this smoke baby can just go from A to B like that and kill, and we can't kill it, can we? I can't believe we've just killed Renly off like that. I'm from, and Brienne is absolute. She's had a meltdown. This was her whole life just killed in front of her. Hell hath no fury like a woman scorned, and that Brienne is feeling so much emotion right now. I won't leave him. So much emotion right now. She is going to go mad. She's going to go mad. Shit is going down now. Well, I can't believe we've just done that. Does his brother know that his son, the smoke baby, just killed his brother? Stannis will be here in an hour. When he arrives, Renly's bannermen will flock to him. Your former companions will fight for the privilege of selling you to their new king. Absolutely no loyalty if they do that. But they're out to protect themselves. You've got to remember these humans aren't involved. They don't get the gold. They don't get the fancy wine every night. They just need to keep themselves alive. I get it. What do you desire most in this world? Revenge. Revenge. But if it is justice that you want, be smart about it. Be smart about it. Okay, at least Littlefinger's giving some of his frigging knowledge. Be smart about it. Please. There's nothing like a good head scratch to persuade someone. Honestly, that would change my opinion on so many things. Just giving me a little head scratch. Okay. Whatever you say. Do you want to be a queen? No. No. 
I want to be the queen. Oh, Marjorie. You and little finger have a little bond going on. Your little fingers are entwined in each other. Marjorie, you have shocked me a little bit there. Not one tear shed for Renly. I know that they weren't like actual lovers, but they were close and she they were good to each other. She's gonna go do whatever she needs to be to be the queen. Stannis Baratheon is coming for us. Sooner rather than later. Aren't there other things you should be doing, like sealing my daughter in a crate so you can ship her away? Sexy. Get over it. Get over it. You want to do all these disgusting things to Sansa and all these other people? Well, then you've got to deal with the consequences for your own family. No need to concern yourself over it. The king is taking personal charge of Cersei. Cersei, if you have faith in your stupid ass son, it's the king's royal prerogative. To withhold sensitive God, she information. Has, actually, she has faith counsels. in Joffrey. What? Is she all right? She's drunk. There's something in that wine. She ain't well. She thrives too much on shitting on Tyrion when actually he's the only brains you've got here behind this whole circus. It's wildfire. Wildfire. Oh, I forgot. He has his little spy. They have thousands of pots. Already stored in their vaults, they are planning to launch it from the city walls into Stannis' ships and armies. I swear to you. Swear to me on what? I, Lancel Lannister, do solemnly oh, vow... All right, enough. Even torturing you is boring. <laughs> Even torturing you is boring. I'm with him. Sorry, and also, what is this little tent set up? This is what I need. Is this like a bed that they transport you on? Sign me up. Sign me up. I need to speak to you all about what I saw in that clear. Yeah, make it clear to you, there'd be no need I've to come speak to tell to you that your son is a cloud of smoke and just went and stabbed your brother. But that cloud of smoke is defending him. Weirdly. Well, well, I mean, it's his son. Technically. You won those bannermen from Renly. Don't lose them to her. We set out okay. for King's Landing without Lady Melisandre. Without her. We've ditched her. Don't think she's going to take that well, mate. I'm not going to lie to you. She's going to get her magic wand out. Corruption! All of the civilians yes. are pissed off Blood at Joffrey. Like, this is corruption. Are we surprised? The queen's bedding her brother. To the tune of a twisted demon. <laughs> you have to admire his imagination. He's talking about you. <gasps> They're blaming Tyrion? You can't blame Tyrion. I know it's hard to believe, but Joffrey, he's a fucking character and there's something mentally wrong with him. It's nothing to do with Tyrion. He's trying to save you. The Starks have overextended their lines. If that dinner's for her, Tywin knows who that is. Oh, it's not for her. That makes a lot more sense. We've underestimated the Stark boy for too long. He has a good mind for warfare. His men worship him. What's hilarious is Arya is in that room right now Hearing all their plans. You've been waiting for him to fail. He is not going to fail. I'm sure your wife must miss you. My wife's in Lannisport. Well, then you better start riding. Not wine, water. Not wine, water. He likes to keep a, a nice, clear head, doesn't he? Girl, where are you from? Maidenpool. And what is their sigil? A red salmon. I think a Maidenpool girl would remember that. He's catching her out. You're a northerner, aren't you? Oh, my... Good. Oh, God. And one more time, where are you from? Barton, my lord. And what do they say of Rob Stark in the north? Oh! What do they say, Arya? They call him the young wolf. They say he rides into battle on the back of a giant dire wolf. Okay, Arya, maybe we shouldn't give... They say he can't be killed. Look, he's looking at her like... Anyone can be killed. Anyone can be killed. She's just reminding him. She's just reminding Tywin, anyone can be killed. Anyone can be killed. A pin goes in you, you bleed. Remember that. <gasps> it's them guys that she saved. It's the guys she saved from the fire. And they had like, they were all kitted out. Here he is. A boy becomes a girl. I was always a girl. And I was always aware. And I was always aware. You're one of them now. I should have let you burn. I should have let you burn. And you fetch water for one of them now. Why is this right for you and wrong for me? Mm. You're staying alive, I'm staying alive. A man pays his debts. A man owes three. You saved me and the two I was with. Three lives I will give you. And we're done. And then we're done. Wow. 
The one who tortures everyone. No, 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 Aria. Think, think it through, think it through. So we're calling the tickler. But he's enough. giving you three people you can kill, and you've chosen him. I get it. You've seen him be a nasty prick. I understand. But there are nastier pricks out there that we need to get rid of. She should have said, thank you so much for your offer. I really appreciate it. Love that about you. What a great guy. Let me just have a think about it. I forgot all about the White Walkers. What? How ridiculous is that? I forgot. Before right, I die, please stop talking. <laughs> that guy is so done with Sam. But it's cute because it's like they have a genuine friendship. He's like a brotherly annoyance to him, you know? Look, this Cora and our fun. Aye. We're we'll living another day. Hurrah. This poor man. I actually feel him. Like, I would be that moaning myrtle in this scenario. The substance burns so hot, it melts flesh. It melts flesh, and that is what she's doing. The jars are him. put in catapult and flung at the and enemy. And then they burn through anything. If it burns through stone, etc., how do they store it? Surely it will just burn through any container they put it in. If you could get real soldiers to mine the catapults, then maybe you'd hit your target one time in ten. Mm, you don't have real soldiers, so you haven't got the skill to be dealing with these catapults. When we're flinging things at Stannis, he's flinging them right back at us. My friend remains unconvinced. Tyrion is like, once you persuade Bronn, I, okay, cool. But he's not convincing Bronn yet. Enough to burn Stannis Baratheon's fleet and armies both. You won't be making wildfire for my sister any longer. Wow, he's stopping it. You'll be making it for me. Uh, what? What? You, you'll be making it for me. Uh. Wow, these dragons are fussy. Look at him, it's so cute. Oh, we got a little... He's cooking his meat. He's cooking his meat with his... I love that. He loves you. He loves you. Oh, we got jealousy. We got the green. We got the green dragon around. Look. Thank you, my friend. They're both fighting. Did you see the dress Zara had made. Fighting for, for her affections. They say he's the wealthiest man in Car. It is known. It is known. Oh, we're back to that. It is known. Look like a real princess in Zara. She's not a princess, she's a Khaleesi. Wow, look, this is a battle between these two. They are getting in each other's wick. You should wear it, Khaleesi. You are their guest. It would be rude not to. Mm. But she's just trying to remind her. Ten minutes ago, you were all about being a Khaleesi. I'm excited. What are they doing? Malako says the statue is too heavy to carry. Kavaro says that Malako is an idiot. He can chop off as much as we can carry. She's getting embarrassed, like, come on, have some decorum. She's got to keep them in, in nick because they're used to a certain way of living. They can't act like this because we need to respect. On behalf of the warlocks of Karth, I welcome you. Oh. Uh... Take this gem. Look at it. No. Into its depths. No, don't do what this bald man is telling you. He hasn't even put his lipstick on properly. Look closely enough and you can see yourself Don't trust in him. Them. Do not... <gasps> Often more than once. Right, Eva, we've got a twin brother, or is it, there is some sp sparky thing going on? It would be an honour to host you at the House of the Undying. You are always welcome, mother of dragons. Mm, I don't understand. It makes me uncomfortable. I'm getting twitchy. What is the House of the Undying? It is where the warlocks go to squint at dusty books ah. and drink shade of the evening. It turns their lips blue and their minds soft. So they're really, technically, they're like drug addicts. They drink a drink that makes their like lips blue and it just, their brains go mushy. You watch over her. Do I know you? Huh? I know you. I'm sorry, but who are you with your face covered in metal? I'm no one, but she is the mother of dragons. And when they see, they shall lust and fire his power. Well, thank you for that information, oh, insightful one, but you can't just sod off. It looked like Stannis. Wow, it looks like Stannis. A shadow in the shape of a man. In the shape of Stannis. Stannis. So that, it's a replica of Stannis in smoke. I do not know your son, my lady, <gasps> but I could serve you. Yes! Snap her up. Sign her up. Get that contract out. And I think that when the time comes, you will not hold me back. Promise me, you will not hold me back from Stannis. Sign her up. Honest to God, that's what we need. We need a bit of spunk.
When the time comes, I will not hold you she, back. The thing with Brienne, I love her, but she needs someone to serve, doesn't she? Like, she doesn't function without bowing down to someone, which is so crazy because you don't see characters like that in Game of Thrones that often. You see them pretend and stab people in the back but you don't see this that much. I like her a lot. I vow that you shall always have a place in my home and at my table. Genuine. So, I've been dreaming of a three-eyed raven again. He can tell the future with his dreams. What did you see in your dream? I dreamt that the sea came to Winterfell. The sea. I saw waves crashing against the gate, flooded the castle. Wow. Crowned when we're floating here. They will drown. The sea is hundreds of miles away. She knows that these dreams mean something, though. Three-eyed raven. What do they say about yeah, it? Just tell me. Crazy things oh, stop running away and just be honest and open with me. We need to be prepared. There's a fire. When the sea is coming, that fire becomes a signal. It gives Mance Raider plenty of time to throw a party in our honour. And the wildlings have joined him. Oh, they're approaching like a party of wildlings. They say we should fall back to the wall. They'll hit us in force. He's basically saying we really haven't got a chance. You need to be more like them. Aha! Think like the enemy. Think like the enemy. Be the wildlings. I'd like to join Lord Corrin. I fought and killed the white. How many rangers can say that? He's the one. I could take up John's duties while he's gone, my lord. Oh, Sam, no you are just the gift that keeps on giving. That little smile, the little shoulder shrug. I'm here for it, Sam. How long has your man servant been in love with you? Wow, look, they've even clocked on that Jura's like head over heels for her. They've only known him two minutes. He must be getting a tent in his pants every time he sees her or something. And they're like, uh, do you want to be less obvious, mate? The gates of the city you bled for me. Why? I will show you why. The door in the vault is made of Valyrian stone. The only thing that can open this door is this key. And it can all be mine. Oh, well, let us say ah. Okay, okay. All I have to do is marry me. I've already married once for love, but the gods stole her from me. Oh. And the same with her. Same with Daenerys. She married... Well, she didn't marry for love. That's absolute bollocks. What am I saying? She did love him, though, in the end. Robert Baratheon is dead. <laughs> <laughs> Moving carefully is the hard way, but it's the right way. And if I'd listened to that advice outside the gates of Carth, would all be dead by now. I only want... What do you want? To see you on the Iron Throne. Why? Dragons! You have a gentle heart. Oh. <laughs> you would not only be respected and feared, you yeah. would be loved. It's true. There are times when I look at you and I still can't believe you're yes, real. Yes, me either. Me either, Jora. Honest to God. Every time I look at her, I think... Make your own way. Find your own ship. You only need one. And how do I get this ship? I'll find it for you. Is that the right way? Like... You need one ship. Really? It's so hard because I see both of their points of view completely. But I am fully on that fence. Like, I have the wood panels up my ass. I'm so firmly on the fence. Oh, Gendry's got his top on. You should stand side face, sideways, smaller target. She's going to teach him how to fight. Oh my God, what? What? <gasps> Three lives. Three lives. And I will get rid of them. We've got one. So well done, Aro. We've wasted one. But okay, whatever. Who's next? Who are you going to go for next? Wow, did you see that? Oh, that's it. Oh, do you know what's amazing with Game of Thrones? It's like they build you up so much. And then they hit you with like these hardcore episodes of just pure torture and abuse and like madness and then the next one is like building you up again to the next episode of just pure madness again they're like stepping stones each time to just have your head blown i can't believe we lost renly really suddenly as well like it was like his life didn't even matter in this and i was just getting i was just starting to get a bond with him i was just starting to like that man Arya and gendry i don't know why i don't know why and i could be so wrong because they could just be a brother and sister relationship but for some reason i i think when she 
is older, they'd be a lovely couple. You know, when she turns 18, which is a long way off, they would make a beautiful, lovely, loyal couple to each other. Obviously, I don't think that's going to happen at all, though. Wow, guys. I can't wait now to see what's going to happen with Stannis and Brienne. And uh, what are we going to do with this wildflower situation? Because we all know hell is going to break loose when that happens. I love it. I just love this show. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, guys, well done. Well done. Well done for sitting through it and watching it with me. Hope you can like, subscribe, comment, all that jazz. And I will see you on the next one. Mwah.